How's it going everybody? Cameron here with Canadian Gamer. Just posting a follow-up video to the video I posted earlier this afternoon. Basically talking about uh, my PS3, uh, you know, kind of hard crashing as I was playing The Last of Us. Now, I posted a small video and I just want to thank everybody who uh, watched the video and uh, more importantly left a comment because... There was just a wealth of knowledge from all you guys that left comments. I couldn't believe it. And I just want to sort of rewind a little bit here and, and just uh, explain a few things. When I bought this console approximately five months ago, that would have been maybe around November, uh, I didn't buy this console from the thrift store. I bought it from an older gentleman. He probably was in his mid, mid to late 50s. And uh, he bought this console, as far as I'm aware, brand new, and he had it babied in his house. This console is mint. Now, I know the exterior doesn't mean that, uh, obviously, there could be other stuff going on inside the console, but I'm just laying out the facts here. I bought this from a one-owner older gentleman. This console definitely was not abused. And uh, more to the point, when I bought the console... Uh, you gotta you gotta remember around November it's pretty pretty cool out. Uh, you could even say it's cold, especially in Canada. Uh, I've got an older house here. It's not the warmest house in the winter, and uh, so yeah, when I bought the console from him, uh, I I left it standing up, uh, as you could see in the previous thumbnail. Uh, that's how I put this console uh, in my unit. Uh, I think this console looks really nice standing up. But you fast forward to we're into April now. I haven't really been playing my PS3. I haven't been playing a lot of anything, to be honest with you. Uh, temperatures have changed. Uh, it's actually quite warm in the house now. And so obviously starting to play the PS3 now. Uh, and this the console starts to hard crash on me. Well... After I posted that last video, uh, I threw on The Last of Us. I started playing it, and not even 10 minutes into it, uh, I went to save my game, and boom, it hard crashed again. So I'm like, what the hell is going on here? So uh, I turned the console back on again, and sure as shit, I put my hand behind the console, and yeah, it was blowing some legitimate hot air. The, the console was hot. So I went back to the comments on this video I just posted. Now, I'm still going through all the comments. I I can't believe how many comments I got on that video. I'm still going through each and every one of them. Uh, no stone shall be left unturned. I have to read all my comments. That's just how I am. So I'll be doing that tonight. But uh, specifically, uh, there was two gentlemen that left uh, comments on my video and one of them, uh, his name is Hedes, and he told me, uh, he left a real nice comment, and he mentioned, you know, possibly turning the console, you know, flipping it around, putting it flat. And then uh, another guy, your Scottish Gamer72, he also mentioned it as well. He said, you can see his comment here, try having your PS3 flat. Sometimes that can help when it's overheating. So... Yeah, that's exactly what I did. I, I, I laid it down. I put it down flat. And uh, sure as shit, it's not extremely hot behind the console. It's not blowing hot air like it was. So that was really, that was the issue. This, this console, at least as far as I'm concerned, with my experience so far, it's just like the Xbox 360. It doesn't like to be... In the standing in the upright position when i when i have my xbox 360 slim model standing up uh the disc drive starts making noises the consoles the you know the the ventilation is just not there so i always leave my 360 slim model flat and uh, i guess it's no exception with the with the older model ps3 i'm gonna have to leave it flat doesn't look as aesthetically pleasing in my entertainment unit, but obviously that's not the main concern. So I laid it flat and I've been playing The Last of Us for the last couple of hours and I haven't had any hard crashes at all. So 
that's that looks to be the root of the problem the console was overheating uh again it has to do with the fact that the console was standing up uh changing of the seasons it's a lot warmer in the house haven't been playing the playstation recently and more to the point i haven't been playing it i've never played it with the room temperature that it is in the house right now got a couple of warm days the last couple days it's going to get warmer so so yeah anyone out there that's experiencing this issue try laying your console flat uh this allows for the heat to disperse evenly uh throughout the unit whereas when you're when you have it standing up there's clearly ventilation issues the console does not like to be standing up so there you have it issue resolved thank you everybody everyone who left a comment i really do appreciate that and uh, yes that's pretty much it i'll leave it at that if there's any further issues obviously i'll let you guys know but this this seems to be resolved so anyways guys thanks so much for watching have a good night